Here's a walkthrough of my house. Walking over some planks right here. This is the office. And uh, I set this window purposefully low so that I have a nice view of the yard out here. This uh, will be leveled later out there and uh, have a nice garden. As you can see, the pipe for the central main power is dug. I used my backhoe for that. And uh, two main windows. This is a window, interior window, so I can see the TV on the wall. And uh, big French doors will be here to let this light in that I, I get. This is the living room area right here. And um, these large windows are six feet by three feet each. And you can see the nice view I get from the southern exposure that comes through all my dead branches out there. Here I um, set up a place for my uh, plasma TV I'll eventually get and pre-ran the wires I'll need and whatnot. Here we have my work bench, my 8x4 workbench. Just pretty much everything I need at the immediate moment. Here's my drywall scaffold lift. Lots of tools here. And my large uh, quarter round, uh, half round window. I just finished drywalling Hanging, hanging all this ceiling panel so it was uh, nice to take a break and shoot some footage here's the PEX wire running through the wall here and the nail plates to protect it and uh, this is just wire here that I'm gonna pull through once you know I've hung that area for the PEX I actually um, ran both on blue so it'd save money because uh, I bought like a hundred foot of blue but from where it branches to half inch from three quarter uh, I used red for where it's hot and uh, the the two hots one runs to the main sink and one runs to the dishwasher down here which I haven't um, run an elbow for yet but I just put a, a stopper on it so that I can pressure test. But right here I basically have the main faucet and this is the bar bench so to speak. I have outlet receptacles at 42 inch all around and uh, in I have a you know ice maker feed right here. This is the uh, pantry slash laundry room slash everything utility room it's gonna be dark in here but you can kinda make out all the different PEX feeds I have I'm just hoping the pressure test will run successfully because there's a lot of connections here's where the uh, main electrical panel is you can see all the feeds dropping down there it's a spaghetti mess right now but here is the um, entryway eventually for the um, the um, cold cold cellar. Sorry, couldn't think of it. And down here we have my uh, whirlpool pump that I had to reroute because originally it was behind the tub, and that was a big project. We have my toilet flange which I had to move and offset there and. Uh, we have the pump and pressure tank, a project still in progress, and we have my feeds here, which will feed uh, the both lines. Again, they're both the main three-quarter inch tubing is blue because I just wanted to buy one kind, but the vertical feed goes to the uh, outside hose bib uh, over the rafters. So it's a good look at it there. 
right here I have uh, knockouts, um, sorry, outlets for a just a little flat panel in the bathroom when I'm in the, the tub there, which would be nice. Here I have um, the uh, all the wiring from the internet, Cat 5E, and the uh, uh, TV antenna. So that's going to be a future project as well. I have propane feeds in there at the range, at the... Uh, dryer and at the washer, wa sorry, heater, water heater. Uh, let's take a, show you a little bit more about the um, bathroom. It's kind of blocked right now by all this drywall, so it's not able to get in there, but there's not really much to see at the moment. Just putting a backer board and um, it's kind of a mess at the moment, but there's six mil plastic on the left side because that's finished and I still have to install the bath vent as well. But most of it's ready and um, just ready for that pressure test. Here's the guest bedroom. There's, uh, I put up these shelving this weekend to hold all my tools and just um, get all these things out of the way. You know, assorted stuff. Big fan of the Ryobi wireless tools, although the batteries kind of stink. They have a short charge, especially mine. But uh, here's the um, my master bedroom. One neat thing I did with the, the closets is uh, these uh, pressure switches right here. Don't mind how nasty it looks, but um, you can see that uh, when the closet's opened, it activates that pressure switch so that'll be nice no switch needed to operate the uh, closet light 